The Culture Recovery Fund has been amazing for us. I think at one stage I honestly didn't think I would have a job to come back to. So to have um, the funding that we've had and to, to actually see all the activity that's been going on and there's a real buzz about the place and it's just been fantastic because I, I honestly thought well you know we're going to be in dire financial straits at Blenheim. You know, no income from our visitors and that's what keeps us going. So, as I say, thank heavens for that, for that fund. It's a, it's a fantastic building. I mean, it's, it's such a wonderful place to be. It's a wonderful place to visit. It's a fantastic place to work. So when I first agreed the Cultural Recovery Fund, I was determined that places like this, part of our rich heritage, would also be beneficiaries of it. And it's been absolutely fantastic to see how they've spent that money improving somewhere like this, making it a great visitor attraction, attracting people potentially from around the world when we reopen. But right now, families in here seeing the experience and having a, a wonderful day out and understanding and enjoying our rich heritage. What I love about this place as well, it's going to be here long after we're all gone. And if you think of the things it's seen, um, we have some of the oak trees in the park are over a thousand years old. So they, were, they started to grow before the Battle of Hastings. So imagine what has gone on during their lifetimes. It's, you know, it's just vast and we're so tiny in all this really. And you can just learn so much and it leads you onto different areas. It broadens your view, it broadens your outlook. In this very building was where our great wartime Prime Minister, Winston Churchill was born. They've opened up a new exhibition. I've even met a real life replica Winston Churchill. So not only have we been able to update it, but we've moved it to a space that enables us to carry out social distancing, which of course is a, a very important thing for us. And we're incredibly lucky to have been able to win that award. A fantastic part of our heritage, and it fits alongside Oxford University just down the road and Vista Village, all of it generating wealth and opportunities. <laughs>